Good morning, everyone. Today we are going to be making a project about Moses, but just a little note, as you see, we don't always wear our matching clothes, but we do have on our matching Piney Paradise sweatshirts today because it is Earth Day when we're making our video. So just so you know, Colt was pretty excited about that. Okay, sit down, please. <laughs> All right, so yes, we're doing all sorts of things to try to keep things exciting during this extensive time at home together. So hopefully you are enjoying our videos. Today we are making a, a burning, burning bush. A burning bush. So this is the example I actually did a test run today since my rainbow didn't work out. And we happen to have a Lego Moses. So there he is with the burning bush. All right, so... um. What you will need for today is a clear cup. Now, and yeah, go ahead. We have a green marker for the This one bush, is a Sharpie. And this one is for the bush. And this one's for the bush. Okay, so so we have fire we colors to make fire. Some, and we use our we scissors go. to cut out this to make that. Very good. All right, so as Colt said, we have a green Sharpie marker and a clear cup. So he's going to use this. Sharpie works better on plastic, so he's just going to make a bush on the cup. Oh, no. It's okay. Just kind of in one area because our fire doesn't go the whole way. While he is coloring, I will say that this calls to use colored tissue paper. But uh, this is the extent of our colored tissue paper. So we are using um, paper towel instead. All right, great. So he has, yep, very good. He has a bush. And now he is going to use our washable markers to color on our white paper towel. Also, um, it calls for a battery operated tea light. We cannot locate ours if we have any in the house and we're, we're not making those unnecessary trips to the store. So I did have some regular tea lights, so that would just be an adult job to light the tea light. So we are obviously using red and orange as fire what colors if you wanted to make some. What does red and orange make? When you put them together, they actually just make kind of like a reddish orange all right so he has some color there and some little more orange very good i used them on different sides because um i like that okay and i uh tried out during my test run, I tried using a sandwich bag because I thought the clear would work better, but then you could see the tea light. So we are going with the white paper towel. And do you want to cut? Okay, so Colt is just gonna kind of trim. Here, I'll make, I'll make orange lines for you to just go around. Okay, so just trim on your orange lines there, okay? Here, I'll start here. Because we want, we want this, this to stay attached behind the bush. There you go. You can finish cutting around your fire then. I have to do that one. It's a little tricky because it's paper towel. You could probably, oh, I was just gonna say, you could probably rip here, let me help you out, mister. So since we kind of have some thick, thick marker there, that's okay. Uh, my brush, my all right, so we might have to do a little repair job, but you can see Colt's fire here. And we'll put that down in the cup like so. And if you want to tape it into place, you can. Mine was a little bit bigger, so you can okay, see. We need a, can, we use can you sit down, mister? Thank you. Okay. So I'll put the candle in for him. Like I said, if you have battery operated, that would be better. Papa. Papa. And it looks pretty cool when you have it in the dark. I'll hold his fire up for him. We'll do a little tape job, but you can see 
Is the bush actually burning up though, Cole? No, that's why you want to put it up high because God no, made it a black. burning bush.